Hi, thanks for stopping by Photography by Daniel. Today I'm going to show you a quick illustration of one reason why I love Macintosh uh, Apple products. Um, you know, as a photographer, I often get inspiration uh, from other photographers' work, and uh, and so I have you know photography uh, inspirational folders and things that I might print out just to you know things I might want to emulate or things I might want to do similar but put my own spin on. Uh, so instead of going to the internet and copying and pasting, you know, saving like you would have to on um, you know on a PC. Uh, I'm going to show you something that's really cool. Um, so as you can see, as I just went to Daniel Penticus, uh, one thing I want to, um, if you go to the web and you know you type in you know sunset or, um, well, you know sunset wallpaper. Well, I mean I don't own these rights, and so I'm going to be very, um, you know, conscious of how I use these and use them for inspiration. I'll never ever uh, use someone else's work and claim it as my own. Uh, so just that little word of caution there because uh, they do sometimes get tracked and you want to be careful okay so <clears throat> um, here is a, a bride and groom uh, that are that I did a while back and so we can just like uh, you can see that will take you directly to their page and you can see how crisp that is uh, so the bride and groom that we did in Dallas uh, very nice couple uh, but let's just say that I wanted to use something uh, like a sunset and and go from there. So let's do that really quick. All right. So let's see here. Uh, okay, that's pretty cool looking. I'm gonna go to original photo. I'm like, wow, that's really pretty. I'd like one day I'd like to learn how to do that type of image. So on a computer, you would have to right click, save, go to folder, whatever. But on a Mac, I'm gonna simply hold down my mouse and I'm gonna drag, drop. And there it is. Um, so that is the the image I just got off the internet. Uh, so I will do that again for you. Once again, I do not recommend if you want to have an inspirational folder. That's one thing, but you do not want to take other people's work uh, and claim it as your own. And let's see, use the original image. Very beautiful, very crisp, kind of neat looking. Only thing, a little sunspot right there, but not a problem. Here we go. Boom, done. I push down, drag, drop. And there it is. All right, well, that's it uh, for today's quick lesson on a Macintosh of how to uh, copy and paste images uh, onto your, uh, you know, inspirational folders and uh, things to look for in the future. Uh, and leave, please feel free to leave any comments, and uh, thank you for your time. Have a great day.